There is still a problem. More gone, because less is more. I tear too. And so it got war and has been used. And so, see, it's been longer than 90 days. These were tore too. They have got their use. These were tore too. So I do like to sew. I hope minimalist lifestyle will give me some time to sew. But obviously I'm not there yet. I'm going to go ahead and allow myself a box. This box. If it does not fit in this box, sewing wise, I'm not keeping it. This is all I'm going to allot myself a project on sewing. Okay. If I have a time where I get more into it, I'll start here and move forward. So, I said box, but then, yes, I use this stuff. Um, sew on a button, things like that. So, here we go. This and my sewing machine is all that's allotted for now. Time to go. Um, this is some Pampered Chef stuff. Time to go. Here is from my Quiznark. Time to go. I can look up all that stuff online. This is Pampered Chef stuff. Time to go. We did Blue Apron when they had maybe JC. So it's been about five years. They were good recipes. I thought, oh, I'll keep them. These are great. Gotta go. We have not recreated one of these recipes, and I'll repeat this, not one. Not even one. Hello, today we're going through papers and kind of what we've claimed as our pantry area. Um, so, I'm a little, I'm annoyed. Um, so far, what you've seen us do has made progress, and we've caught up on things, or we've kind of stayed ahead. We feel better, but it's not a lasting effect. It's like an achievement here, and it's like stress and failure everywhere else. So today, I'm going to tackle this. Um, some because this is kind of our schoolwork area. This is our pantry area. This is an area that will just help. We have gone through blankets and quilts. Um, even kid ones, things like that. We've gone through a plethora of stuff, and I've been amazed at how much we have found, but I'm still super amazed at how much is left. Um, I just overwhelmed with this, and I'm trying to keep in my head the finished product. Um, that's what I'm trying to let motivate me. Sad, I found manuals from like 15 years ago, and from like eight years ago we don't even have this house anymore and there are manuals to things that the house had in it gosh this was depressing i am just even more annoyed at the fact that i have this stuff to still go through it's okay we can do it we can do it do it do it what would you get rid of right now if you really just could or what would you like to blink and it never be there again if you could all right, this is go. This is storage. This is tax papers. Just one of those perks. All right, good. This is trash plus some keep. That is some keep. And then in here, I got to re-put these back in. I got to make this better. Um... I gotta make this better. Just keep telling myself that. How can I make this better? Because I need to have all this stuff neater and much more nice. Because this is food stuff we're using. And I want surfaces clean. So I'm going to also need to. What? deal with all this stuff um i just gotta make better gotta keep going forward
that was two bags of trash gone. As you can see, laundry is still a mess. We still have that to work on. That's coming up in future videos. <sighs> Those are clean. They're just not put up. Alright. Over here. So we've made room for some bulk items. This right here, I want to get back to using these and making our, those were my sweet crackers. I use them making sweet crackers. But since, well, Bubba, you gotta be careful. Are you okay? So no, I just hit myself in the head. Move, move, come here, come here. Did you hit yourself in the eye? We didn't really like this salsa. We tried it. So, back out here. I'm going to go ahead and food pantry this. I want this. I want this. Um, that's, that's rice, Bubba. You know this. this. Alright. We're going to uh, use these. Hold on, Bubba. Uh, can somebody go over there and hand me the bread and the crackers? And no, I need you to stop. What do you mean? I said crackers. Crackers. Yes, yeah, all that. All right. Well, then you can clean it up. I make messes too. It's kind of hard sometimes. All right, JC, let me see the breads. And JC, I'm gonna have you put these down here. You're a really good organizer. Put them. Or you can go put the bunny up. Okay, put that in there. Put it. Give it to mom. Would you like to hold the baby bunny? You can go give it to dad. Okay. Here, hold her like. Hold her. Nope. 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 Here, hold the baby bunny. And this is blueberry, y'all. Here's that. Because our boxes will do good down here. Mommy, show her. Just hold her. Just hold her. Just hold her. She's good. Okay, well, if you here. don't, go give it to Bubba. Go give her to Bubba. Go give her to Bubba. He like home right? Okay, there was a marker down there. Did not really like these. Sorry, Bertoli, but they they were not that good. So we'll go ahead. Hold on, we'll go ahead. They've supposed to have been in here cleaning their room. They have minimal to clean, but for some reason books and papers. If I've got to do it, they do too. This hasn't been all morning, but I told the kids to come in here and start bagging up stuff. JC's unsettled about it, and yes, that tugs at my heartstrings, but I know what this finished product does for us. I just know it, and I'm striving for it. And it's not like we can't um, come back from getting rid of too much stuff. We will re accumulate more stuff. But look, they've been in here for hours. I told them to clean. Then I was like, okay, we, we're, if we can't get in here and do it, then it's too much. Um, so, I'm going to show y'all this room after like two hours. of, And then like an hour of bagging up. This is a waste of life, having this. Look. And they have the most beautiful quilts that their grandmother had made for them. Like, this stuff's clean. This, I just see my little adult children struggling like me. You know, they're little right now, but they'll still be my little children when they're adults. And I'm struggling myself. And I just can't help feel like this is too much. So, I want to have better and more for them. So, I asked each one of them. I said, and I went from oldest to the youngest, I said, what would your ideal day be at home? 
And they said this. They said, getting up, watching TV, and each one of them gave something they were eating. One was popsicles, one was cheese, and the other one would be at Grandma's. <laughs> And she'd be having Cheez-Its, and they were all going to be watching a movie. Oop. So, I just think that if that's really where they would like to spend enjoyment time together, watching TV. Yes, I'm not the biggest fan of TV, but we watch it probably every day. Why do we need this stuff? And I asked them, I said, do you want to do more chores or do you want to have more time for things that are enjoyable and they all said time for more enjoyment um so i just am overwhelmed at how much stuff we've had leave already and how much stuff we're finding to leave so here's their pile that they've already bagged up okay and I'll tell you what I told them. I said, go in there with one trash bag and get the trash off the floor. And they started doing this. So we'll be back. We've got some farm chores to tend to. And then we're going to come back and finish more decluttering. So I'm really thinking this. I really would have liked to when we moved a year and a half ago made a list of what I needed and I only brought it and then opened up free house items come and get that would have made me a lot happier a whole lot happier just to have brought what I honestly needed but minimalist was not on my idea we had a lot going on with the move so but it's kids stuff 